Ed Slimstone here with our third and final installment of Karaoke Classics Part 1. Here is Snipster's 665's version of Guns N' Roses. Sweet child of mine. Roll that footage. Who died and left him, boss? Oh, yeah. This is my jam. We picked a good song now. Nothing like Guns N' Roses. Got a little air guitar there, buddy. You've been playing the Guitar Hero too long. He's pushing the orange buttons and the green buttons again. Why does every karaoke singer sing this song? Come on, people. Sweet child of mine, come on. Looks like everybody's getting into the song so far. Well, you gotta say he has a remarkable stage presence. He just moves to the left, then he moves to the right, then he moves to the left. Hey, at least he's dressed the part, okay? He could be a geek underneath all that, but... Alright, not bad, not bad, you know. I've heard worse. I hear Al Axel is worse by the time he gets to the uh, his uh, 12th show. He's not bad. He's not Axel Rose. We'll call him uh, Axel uh, Wallflower. That's what we'll call him. Axel Wallflower. Yeah, he needs to work on his, like, stage presence. Because now he just looks silly. At least they can say he's staying on key. He's keeping up with the song, you know. That's all I can say, really. See that part right there? Well, I can do the one. Ah! I, well, <coughs> I've been sick. I've been sick a little bit. I'll give it, I'll give it another shot. Ah! <coughs> yeah, when I'm feeling better, I'll come in and I'll do it exactly. He sounds pretty decent. Okay, so far he's doing a good job, but that song's not over yet. He's looking to the left, he's looking to the right, he's seeing if there's any girl at all in this bar that's impressed. How about you, honey? No? How about you, honey? How about you, oh, I'm sorry, that's a man. But, you know, give the audience a show. That's what you're up there for. It's a performance. Perform. Give me, give us something, you know. Okay, what the hell is that? What is he doing? What can you say for karaoke night? Uh, you know, it's all a scam anyway. They get the entertainment for free. Some guy shows up, puts on a bunch of records, lets the audience entertain everybody, then he takes the money home. You know what that's called? That's called a scam, buddy. That's called a scam. You're getting ripped off, buddy. Axl Rose gets paid to sing. He doesn't go into a bar and say, oh, well, please let me sing. Hit, uh, hit the music and uh, you get paid. Axl Rose gets paid to sing. You can't even get laid to sing. You're no Britney Spears. I mean, 
apparently he should have done some warm-ups before doing this song because now his voice is fine. I don't understand this. How long is this song? Because I don't have all day. I got that lunch, dinner coming up, got a dentist appointment. This thing is going on longer than uh, Guns N' Roses' last tour. Very creative. I like that. That's all he's doing now. He's like he's like a freaking twister now, walking in circles. That's not what a rock star does. I don't care because I don't like Axl Rose. I don't like Guns N' Roses. I don't like heavy metal. I don't like this show. I don't like this guy. I don't like his clothes. I don't like karaoke. I don't like Christmas, Easter, anything. So it really doesn't matter, does it? Oh, now he's finally off the stage, thank God.